Hey Cake Nistas, it's Marisha from Marisha's Couture Cakes and today I'm going to show you guys another little craftsy type of situation. I'm going to be using these cupcake liners to make something really, really cute. And that's another cupcake topper and it looks like this. It's for Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is only three weeks away. So we kind of need to start planning these things out right now. You know what I'm saying? It's frilly, it's fun, and I like it. And it's a heart shaped, and you can do it with or without the ribbon. So the kind of wrappers that I'm going to be using today are these miniature cupcake wrappers. They say sweet on the bottom because they're oh so sweet. And these are from Wilton. These were actually purchased at Home Goods. You're also going to need scissors, a glue gun, and popsicle sticks or long toothpicks. These are Woodsies. I use these all the time and they are from Joann's. I'm going to use about eight liners. Of course, if you want to go thicker and frillier, you would use more. So you're just going to basically take each wrapper flip it inside out so that only the white part is showing and fold it in half and this is the first step you're not really going to flatten it out too much to lose the frills because you do want some of those in there but this is basically all that you do for right now so we're going to do all of the liners and then we go to part two are you ready I am so now you're just going to stack these together so that they're all facing the same way. They'll look exactly the same. So that it looks like this. Now if you don't feel comfortable with freehand cutting, please feel free to draw out a heart shape and then put it up against your liner and cut around it. Act like this is half of a heart, okay? So you're just going to basically cut out a half of a heart just going around and just make that nice little dip in the center. And then I'm going to trim all of the liners up so that everything is very uniformed. Basically think of like a booklet. I'm just going to put glue right along the center edge of the heart. And this is why I like using a glue gun because you can be very, very precise. And if you would like to, you could definitely, when you're done, do one strip of glue in the center to hold them all together. I'm going to take our stick and I'm going to use the thinner side to put a little bit of glue on the very tip. And then glue this to the center of the bottom of your heart. Now all you have to do is just start opening up each flap letting it flap in the wind a little bit kind of make sure that it's not all glued together now as you're just opening up all of the flaps find how you want to display it like which flap you want to display it on you can have it either looking like this or you can actually open it up a little bit I actually like it both ways I like it this way more Here are the cupcakes with the toppers. They are just as cute as I told you guys that they would be. I love the ratio. They're like nice and big and bodacious and just everything. I hope that you share these with your Valentine and I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like it and don't forget to share and please subscribe for more. Send me a comment below if you would like to keep in touch and find me on Facebook. You can at facebook.com slash Marisha's Guitar Cakes. You can go to my delicious blog, it's sure to make you hungry, at mauritiuscouturecakes.com. And if you guys make these really, really cute toppers, you must keep me informed, because I would like to see what you guys do with them. So tag me on Instagram, at mauritiuscouture. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.